Hello friends and welcome back. I hope you're having a wonderful day. My name is Jessica. If you are new, I like to make motherhood content. That about wraps it up. Everything to do with motherhood. Hauls, cooking, cleaning, organizing. I do it all. So if you like that, stick around. Today, I'm going to be doing a little bit of housework and a tiny bit of homeschooling. Not too much because the boys weren't into it that they weren't into it. And then a grocery haul and a christianbooks.com haul. So I hope you enjoy this video quick Walmart haul really quick and actually it's a Walmart and Sam's haul and it's not organized at all but as you can hear I sound like poo because my allergies are nuts today so I'm just gonna go through here really quick and show you our quick grocery pickup we got some charcoal king's Hawaiian rolls hamburger buns some bunny bread milk apple juice mac and cheese cups, strawberry fruit and grain cereal bars, some lactose free milk, big pack of these chips. We have the plain Lay's classic, the barbecue, Doritos, crunchy Cheetos, Bunions, Fritos, and chili cheese. Some bottled water for the kids to use their flavor packs in. 24 pack of Mountain Dew, three of my chicken dipping sauces. This stuff sells out and they don't have it, so I always stock up on it. Um, what is this? Some top sirloin, some more top sirloin, and chicken, boneless, skinless chicken thighs. Some first and chips, cookies, uh, chocolate donuts. Here's the flavor packs I was talking about. It's got, oh, I feel awful. Fruit punch, cherry, grape, Orange Early Rise. The boys really like these. Some barbecue sauce. Ketchup. My favorite Dawn Power Wash and the apple scent. I love the apple. It's really, it smells really good. Some orange juice. There's six of those. Some AHA Sparkling Water. It's watermelon and lime. I'm going to try that out. Justin said it's nasty, but... And my mom did too, so it might be gross, but we're gonna try it anyway. Then we have three packs of these um, fun pops. We're gonna put those in the deep freeze. And some dial antibacterial soap. We got two bars of that. Some pediatric shakes, the chocolate flavor. I guess really likes those. It makes me feel good to know he's getting his nutrition because he doesn't eat for the darn. Some peanut butter bites, the double peanut butter. These are mine. Oh, another pack of the water flavors. Some Diet Dr. Pepper. And a pack of light bulbs. Some more donuts. And then... One more thing, two pack of whole chickens. Oh, and a two liter of Mountain Dew. So let me show you the sparkling water. Oh, and also this thing of, what is it? Sunny D. This thing, of, oh my gosh, let it go, let me have it. Of Sunny D. That thing is heavy. Okay, here's the sparkling. Here's the sparkling water. I've never tried it. I've never seen anybody talk about it, but there's no sodium in it and no sweeteners. So we'll see how good or disgusting this is. If you had it, let me know if you like it. But anyway, yeah, that is the Sam's and Walmart grocery haul. So here's a before of putting the groceries away. I've got to go through the leftovers, get rid of that stuff, and move things around because during the week it gets shifted but it's still staying in pretty good condition after organizing it now it is restocked for the week the leftovers just has some these little kids cereal bars they often didn't finish and then we have some taco bell leftover set we will eat today i restock the drinks sun shakes and sparkling water so oh and i've got to put these in a different container because my son just took a lid off and lost it already. So I've got to find a container for the cantaloupe, but other than that, it's restocked for the week. Honest. Yes. Thanks. Go my school. Wait. 
What's your card say? Dr. Crazy plans to give a birthday gift of six Do it? Yep. Oh, you can pick your nose. <laughs> wow, you actually drew the line. I'm so proud of you. Wow. Did you ever stop and think why spend too much time just getting ready? These dishes are actually left over from yesterday. I did a whole load and then still had another load left because I caught behind, of course. Then I took a break in between to take a really hot bath and then I couldn't do the rest of them because I ran out of hot water. So I'm just finishing those up today and cleaning my sink out. I love to shine my sink. And my hands start shaking all of the time when you're around me. But this time, this time, girl, I know what's bothering me. I need somebody to love. Oh, na 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 na. Don't you see what's wrong with me? I need somebody to love. Oh, oh, na na. I don't. put away the dishes that I have drying and then I'm gonna um, start doing some laundry. So why, so why, why don't you come on over and be my somebody to love? I'm pretty sure I've shared with you how much I love this basket before. But when I think of laundry, I picture this basket and it just motivates me to do it. I don't understand why. Do you have something that motivates you to get your laundry done? Is it a favorite hamper, a favorite laundry detergent? Let me know, I'm curious. I just absolutely love this basket. I also don't want you to think that I did all of this laundry today. No, honey, this is like three days I'm behind and I'm just catching up today. This is probably, um, Four, three or four loads I'm not certain but when I don't feel good I just don't do anything it, it's very hard for me to get out of the bed and just do the minimum so I have one day when I really just play catch up and today is that day and right here it makes me think of Cinderella when um, Gus Gus the little mouse is trying to pick up all the cheese and he's got probably eight slices between his chin holding it with his two hands on the bottom. And when he reaches for one that dropped out, all the cheese bits fell everywhere. Do you know what I'm talking about? That scene cracks me up and I just, I love thinking about it and I don't know, I'm crazy, I guess. No, you won't remember what I'm talking about because I'm a dingbat. It's not cheese he's holding. It's actually the little bits of chicken feed that Cinderella had for the chickens. Now, I love this towel rack. A lot it's really not that difficult to put these towels up but for some reason today I was having the hardest time getting this big fluffy towel to fit so I eventually just have to move it to the top rack and then I can't find our other master bath towel that's a little thicker to fit into the second from the top rung you'll see out there a little bit of skinny thing up there but it is what it is whatever I love this towel rack y'all should definitely get it if you need towel storage Of course, 
since I've put the laundry away, I'm saying that I need to straighten up their dressers because it's just a big fat mess. But it's not terrible. Just needs a little TLC. You know what I'm talking about. <laughs> Like to put a disclaimer here. Uh, usually they would put away their own clothes, but I enjoy doing it, so they're outside playing happily right now. I am not doing my up right now, so I'm gonna do it. Let's open it, see what it is. Hey! Now I'm gonna show you what came in that box. I'm really excited about this. So, um, I think this is the last bits of our fall curriculum. I'm losing my words, so here it is. Okay, so I saw these little books. Um, it's a funny story, actually. I just saw one, and it was this one. And they are a God I Need to Talk To You About series, and they're very short. I had no idea how big they were or if there was a lot of words, but I thought the subject was good. So I put add to cart and as I did, it would show me another one. So we have uh, disrespect, greed, homework, bedtime, video games, healthy eating, talking back, paying attention, whining, lying, and my bad temper. This is a good one right now. So anyway, I bought all of those and they were on sale for 99 cents a piece. Not bad. And the kids actually read them and like them. So I'm excited about that. And then I went ahead and picked up the Story of the World activity book to go with our Story of the World book because the kids get bored just listening to me read. And I haven't gone through this yet, but I've seen other moms on here do a flip through. And it has coloring pages and maps crossword puzzles so I thought that was really cool so I've got this and then for science I decided to use God's design for life from master books and I haven't looked at it yet so if you've used this let me know and let me know what you think about it but anyway that is our little christianbook.com haul I've tried to film this outro six times in 30 seconds can I just say suck at them and I apologize. I'm very grateful for you for staying to the end. If you did, give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. I hate saying goodbye. Maybe that's why I'm not good at them. But um, subscribe if you're new. I'd love to have you join my family and be grateful. Chips. Love you. Love you. Dad, can I have some chips? Dad. I'm not redoing this. I love you guys, but I can't, I can't, I cannot mentally Dad. handle doing this again. Yay. Be grateful. Give grace. God bless. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.